Technoblade was one of the biggest and most loved Minecraft content creators, and as you probably heard, he sadly recently passed away. My tribute to our favorite piggy is this cute little working gumball machine made of Lego in the shape of his head. But why did I make this? Let me explain that really quick. If you have been with me since the early days of Lego Technics rule, Hello YouTube, I'm going to show you. Okay, maybe not that long ago, you probably noticed me being much less active on YouTube in the 2019 to 2021 range. There was a reason for this. A very particular reason. I discovered Technoblade. After viewing him for a while, he inspired me to play Hypixel Bed Wars too because, well, it looked fun, of course. This distracted me from my other interest in, well, Lego, and therefore I did not upload as much. To this day, I still play Hypixel every so often, and therefore I can say that Technoblade was a pretty big part of my life. Anyway, without further ado, let's get started. This is my tribute. So, to operate the machine, you first need to insert a quarter into the side. After that's done, you can turn his nose one revolution to get a gumball. If you don't insert a quarter, you can spin it all you want, but nothing will happen. If you try to fool the machine with coins of lesser value, such as dimes, nickels, and pennies, it will steal the coins and they will be lost forever. You know what happens when you try to fool Technoblade, don't you? However, when a quarter is inserted, the nose can be turned 360 degrees and Techno will spit out a gumball for you. Delicious. Let's see that a few more times. The machine can be refilled by removing Technoblade's cranium and adding more gumballs to the hopper. After refilling, just seal her back up. The profits can be retrieved by removing a small panel on the back of the machine with some double-sided tape and slightly tipping it to get the coins out. Again, after that's done, just seal her back up. The way the machine works is actually quite simple. Coins smaller than a quarter will pass under this bar and fall into the coin collector. Quarters, however, will hit the bar and push it backwards, loading a gumball. After the quarter falls into the coin collector, a second bar then pulls the first one back into place, releasing the gumball. Simple, right? There is a second mechanism that ensures the nose remains horizontal after using the machine. It consists of a flat piece pressing down on a square piece locking the nose at 90 degree intervals. You can see that each time I release the nose, it automatically springs back to one of its 90 degree positions. Here's a 3D model of it to really show how it works. There is constant tension on the top piece pushing it down. This forces the square piece to lay on one of its sides no matter where it is. Anyway, rest in peace, Technoblade. You've been a big part of a lot of our lives. Thank you for that, and also thank you for watching. See you in the next one.